What's going on everybody? It's BC9 for XYZ. Welcome back to Fallout 3. We are going to go ahead and get injured. <laughs> as horrific as that sounds. This is easy. I'm gonna save before I do this, of course, because I really don't want this to happen but badly, but literally just jump down here. Ah! There we go. Oh, that didn't work. What? That didn't work? That's weird. Well, that worked. The best part is, we've got to walk all the way back like this. That was easy, right? Well, how do you feel? Oh, don't think of it as crippling yourself for me. Think of it as getting free treatment when you eventually end up getting yourself hurt. Well, how do you feel? Wait, what? Well, I could hardly be... Hmm, how about I just leave you alone for a bit? Huh, did you know the human body can serve... What's going on? Never had this problem before. Better? There we go. I didn't mean to. I feel bad. I didn't mean to do the shooting one. I just wanted to see what would happen if she said it. What's up? Anything interesting out there in the wild wasteland? Well, how do you feel? This really hurts, you know. <laughs> oh, I know it does, dear. But it's for a good cause. Uh, try not to squirm so much while I take notes. Now, how would you describe the pain you're feeling? Any advice for how to keep it from being overwhelming? And remember, this is for posterity. Despite my glossary of explicit, nothing properly sums up this pain. You? At a loss for words? Oh, it's worse than I thought. <laughs> Luckily, I'm here to patch you up. Now hold still and, and, and quit fidgeting. Ugh. How can you be walking around like this? Okay. I even stitched a little smiley face in you to keep up your spirits. It's kind of hard to see from your side, though. Here, take this environment suit of mine. It will help with medical tasks, and it should help prevent the effects of exposure, too. Ready for the second chapter again. There's a sort of mole rat repellent I've developed. So we're going to go ahead and do the uh, mole rats. Mole rats can burrow into almost anything and cause a lot of trouble. So I figured I'd make a chemical repellent stick for people to shoo them off but I need it to be tested before I put the recipe to paper in the guide. So I need you to find some mole rats and test it out a bit. Sure, test out the repellent. It'll be easy. One tap with the applicator and it overwhelms their senses with a sort of feel bad sensation. Then they're gone before you know it. You could test it out on just a few mole ratties, but for real testing, try it on 10 or more. There should be plenty in the tepid sewers downtown. Alright. Do you have anything for sale yet? You don't. Um, well. Do you have any stim packs? You do. I'll take all of them. That way I can give you stuff.
Oh, I forgot that I found an environment suit. Okay, cool. Um... Good hunting! Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna find the other... What's shaking? ...things around town to repair here. Okay. The last leaking pipe, I believe, is over here. Actually, wait, what am I saying? Glorious we saw the leaky pipe. I give unto you these yes. bones. Hey there. I present you. And give relief to this rotten hey there, flesh. Andy. Good evening. Adam settlers. Probably in here. Has to be in here. <laughs> Whoops. What do you need? Pipes are all fixed. Well, I'll be. The pressure's up in the plant. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. If I have a steady supply of scrap, I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Sounds good to me. I'll bring your parts you find. I find, I mean. Good. This just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. Yeah, what is it? I sure am, Sonny. What have you got for me? Just take all the scrap metal I have. Well, all right. Let me count out your caps. So now you can sell, you can actually give him the scrap metal for karma if you wanted. And when we get to a point where we can do that, we might actually, but. I think I might wait until, uh... Whoops. God damn it. This is why they autosave after you exit a building. Running mechanics look so bad. How may I serve you, Master? Let's do twelve hours. He wants to dollar. Yeah, I'm no longer well rested. I slept for 12 hours. Let's head over here. Sorry. Actually, really pretty. 
Why don't I go ahead and save? Holy sun, wow. Oh god, centaurs. Um, hold on, let me just pause battle quickly. Uh, these guys are annoying as fuck, actually. Oh. guys here too. No. Alright, I'm done. Done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. real? I'm safe? I I need to get out of here. Here, take these supplies. It's all I have, but they'll only slow me down. I'll take that and I'll get out of here. They won't catch me again. spending nuclear Armageddon trapped with him in a fucking closet. You can have my number. It's six. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got a mushroom cloud to walk into. Have a happy holocaust. Whoa. Hmm. So yeah, here's the uh, river. That happened. A minor lurk. I fucking hate minor lurks. Minor lurks are so annoying. <sighs> you have to hit it right in the eye. Supposed to go. <laughs> All right. 
here we go. Have it sewers. Turrets down here, which is kind of weird. I can just do this. It's the gas chamber. Looks like an outside door. Oops, not. Fuck! Ah! Oh! Alright, we're gonna go back this way. There's gotta be more. Oh! Ow! Oh. oh my god, you fucking assholes. <gasps> That does.
so much for that. It looks like all the raiders killed all of them. Oh well. All right. Of course, there's an enemy nearby, so I can't fucking fast travel. Great. Great, great, great. Good? Okay, good. That was fun, wasn't it? All right, I'm gonna turn this quest in and I'm gonna call it a video. I've been bleeding for like an hour now. Oh, I can't wait to hear how the repellent's working. Just a few? Well, I'm sure it'll be good enough. So, how did my chemical repellent work? Safe and clean like a charm, I bet. Um, well, at least it's not leave over people. For mole rats, not so much. <laughs> Oh, that isn't what I want at all. People already have all sorts of ways to kill them. We don't need a more lethal mole rat trap. Just a better one. I guess it's back to the drawing board for that repellent. I wonder if I can make it into some sort of fuel. Anyway, I'll just take that. Thank you. Oh, but for your trouble, um, here. Have the leftover chems from working on the repellent. I'm sure you can find some use for them. Last part of the chapter is about my orcs. Yes, knowing more about them can help people learn to avoid or even outsmart them. So I picked up this observer device to study them in their natural habitat. I need you to hide one in one of the spawning pods in their lairs. All right, I'll try. That's great. I recommend the nest at the Anchorage War Memorial. I knew a trader who talked about the Meyer Lurks down there. Just go inside and find one of their spawning pods. Probably down near the water. Put this observer inside and get out quietly. And be sure not to kill any Meyer lurks inside their nest. If you do, it could ruin the validity of the study. All right, sounds good. All right, we're gonna call it a video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time on Fallout 3.